here for the scaled female final. And in first place, we have SSB Untamed. In second, Aggressively Average. In third, B-Town Dio Gloria. Lane four, Rigs and Stigs. Lane five, 152 Wad Witches. Lane six, Flock Around and Find Out. Lane seven, Scaled Tippers. And then uh, if we look at the scores there, look at eighth place, Nomads. Unfortunately, three, seven, nine. Unfortunately, falling out of uh, the final there. It's gonna be, we're not going to be able to commentate that. And remember, this is a staggered start, so these athletes are going to be uh, starting in first. And if you have 10 points, you will have 10 points ahead of the second place team. You will have a 10 second lead and so on. So staggered start here. When you get onto station one, as soon as you jump onto your cardio machine, that cardio machine is your cardio machine for the entirety of the 25 calories. Or oh, sorry, I think they're hitting 30 calories. Yeah, 30 calories for the ladies here in the scale division. Great shots here on that assault rower. Remember, 30 calories. When you start on your your cardio machine, you stay on that cardio machine. So you gotta you gotta talk amongst your team. You gotta have an idea of who's the better runner, who's the better person on the assault bike and the row. And uh, for instance, yesterday there were a couple of decisions there because I know a couple of the guys, and I I wondered to myself why was that person on the runner, and uh, it kind of felt like they didn't think about that. And beautiful shot here. You can see the lady here on the run at the moment. Great shots from our cameraman. And just a huge shout out to that team there on the floor right now. It is baking. We've had a couple of people, some of the judges come off the floor struggling. And that 152 Barbellas, sorry, Wadwitches on your screens right now out there in Pine Slopes. And it, here we go, we have uh, Great shots here, as we see all the teams there. Still on the cardio machines, I think uh, lane one, however, they've moved into the next buy-in. There they are now on your screens. And it looks like lane two. So FSB untamed and aggressively average. They are currently neck and neck by the looks of it.
And lane number three in the mix there. Sorry, lane number yeah, lane number three in the mix as well. So V Town Dio Gloria, they in the mix here. And just looking at those squats, it looks like lane number two are cycling a little bit faster. However, lane one are done and dusted there. And they're moving into those cleans and clean and jerks with the worms. Remember, they have to show clear control once that worm goes over their head and lands on the shoulder. So we'll be uh, looking out for that over the head, onto the shoulder, and then they can drop it. They can't just throw it over their heads and drop. It has to come back down onto the shoulder with control. So, untamed lane one, our current leaders. In second place, we have aggressively average. And then in third, V-Town Dio Gloria. We're going to see, will there be a massive change up as we saw earlier on in the, the foundational division? Just asking some questions there. It's going to be interesting to see who comes out of this next as our leaders. At the moment, I think lane one, FSB Untamed, will still be our leaders. You can see none of the other field is, uh, and as I say that, another team's come up there. Yeah, we see the rest of the teams here. Yeah. These guys are still have an opportunity if they can get these cleans right. They have an opportunity to still sneak into a top three position. Remember, it's winner take all here. Lots of talking going on there. 100% sure what's going on there. We'd love to uh, have those judges mic'd up so we can know exactly what's going on. That would be really great. Maybe that's something we look into into the future, mic up those judges. Remember, they got those 30 clean and jerks. This is probably the longest part of this workout. We've seen a couple of times now in the men's as well as the foundational earlier on that it takes some time for them to get through the clean and jerk show with the worm. But after this, you'll see it starts uh, flowing nicely and those floodgates pretty much open and you see all these teams start battling it out. That earlier division, the foundational, was an absolute banger of an event. Super exciting. And these athletes are really, really struggling in this final, the scale. I'd even say that, uh, and look at that. I think we got brand new leaders, we do. It looks like lane number four, Riggs and Stiggs. Riggs and Stiggs have got this knack of uh, coming from behind and just 
walking away with it. I've seen them in a couple of competitions now, not just here at the battle. And they always have this uh, knack of coming from behind and then putting in a great effort. So a lot of the athletes struggling with that worm at the moment. I'd even go as far as to say that the foundational ladies previously uh, fared a little bit better. Obviously, different movement. It's a clean versus a clean and jerk. However, I do feel like the foundational ladies fared a bit better in terms of the strength department there. But uh, here comes lane one. They now back into the mix. They got the hard part behind them. FSB untamed. They have an opportunity now to uh, get back that lead. And remember, there's a sink at the bottom, a sink at the top, and there, no reps. There we go, they've now got their rhythm once again. That is FSB Unattamed. But our leaders at the moment in lane number four, that is Riggs and Stiggs. Remember, lock out at the top. And then when they come down, they need to lock out those elbows. Four reps. Three reps remaining. Two more for our lady here on screen. final eight minutes and remember they are mirroring on the snatches so if you're lifting with your left hand the other athlete is lifting with the right hand lane one back on to the pullovers Riggs and Stiggs, still your leaders. Still one more round here for lane number one. I think they got a little bit confused there. And I think this will be Riggs and Stiggs' final one. Or, well, final two reps, but I mean final uh, round. She's just ripped, it looks like it. As we see lane one and lane three battling in Archer, that is Untamed as well as Vita and Dio Gloria. Fighting over all these athletes trying to get those pullovers. Two more here for lane one. But it looks like. I think that lane one might just be back in the league, or am I wrong here? Um, at the moment, Riggs and Stig's still on. 
No, so Riggs and Stig still in the lead at the moment, but not too far behind. Probably about two reps behind is lane number one. That is FSB Untamed. And I got a little bit of a glimpse of her hand there, and it looks like that hand definitely did rip. Saw some blood in the hands. And uh, I think we might just have new leaders here in lane number two. That is aggressively average. Aggressively average. Our new leaders. Oh, sorry. Vitan Dio Gloria, I think. I'm, I think that was lane three. Vitan Dio Gloria, our new leaders in this one. And our 152 ladies here. Yeah? What witches? And then remember, we had a change of leadership. Riggs and Stiggs in lane four, they were the leaders. Then in lane three, Vio Town, Dio Gloria, they are now your brand new leaders. She uh, forgot her bar, that she had to move her bar before she can go. And uh, moving her bar now and off she goes. But uh, not too far behind, we got lane number one, that is FSB Untamed. They now moving up into the same section. And that, let's see how many reps V-Town has over them. That's three now. So five reps is the lead that V-Town Dio Gloria has. And now they're transferring. Not too sure that's a wise move. That transfer is so long. We might just see lane one, FSB Untamed, move into that number one spot. And it's still maintaining that lead, but it is neck and neck. However, here comes Riggs and Stiggs. With one minute remaining for these athletes, Riggs and Stiggs are looking to get into this, uh, the mix here for a possible gold. Plenty of time for things to get shook up here. 40 seconds. 
If Riggs and Stiggs wants that goal, they're going to have to dig deep and go unbroken. Lane one, FSB Untamed, your leaders. They lost it to Riggs and Stiggs. And then V-Town, and now they're back in the lead onto that final 10 with 15 seconds remaining. And that is time, and it looks like FSB Untamed will take the win here, and they are your battle champions. What a great effort by this team. It was back and forth between uh, Riggs and Stiggs, V-Town, and then FSB Untamed walking away with the title and that gold medal. And don't go anywhere. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, the like button, and, of course, the bell notification button.